Okay, Chem Keepers. These come in two packs, five packs, and 10 packs. Here we have a two pack. Get it over the package. We've got two six inch keychain cables and two EPDM bands, rubber bands. These are commonly referred to as Ranger bands. So we started offering Chem Keepers because you guys asked us for them. Our utility hooks, since day one, we've been shipping them with two of these keychain cables to use for carrying chems. Reason being, professionally, we carry chems this way and we think it's a better way to carry chems than some of the other common methods out there, such as 550 cord or carabiners. And so many of you uh, asked if you could get more of these, we started offering these chem keepers. By the way, this is one of the first utility hooks we ever sewed. Still going strong, this thing's seen a lot of use. Okay, so in this case, I've got a couple different types of chem lights here. Just to go ahead and answer the questions, I know it's gonna come up. I have e-tape on this red one so that at night I can feel that this feels different from others. You can wrap bands up here, lots of different ways to differentiate chems, figure out what works for you. Here we've got some green Viz ones, some smaller chems. And to use the chem keeper, you're gonna basically go ahead and thread this through. Make sure you use the threaded side and feed it through your hole. Once you've done that, Go ahead and screw it down and secure itself. I've actually never had one of these come open on me, but if that's something that's a concern for you, go ahead and just run some e-tape around this. Okay, so why the EPDM bands? These are much more durable, and most people who have used Ranger bands will know this. They're much more durable than regular rubber bands, and they handle heat, humidity, uh, moisture, and sun exposure much better. That's why we use these. And as you can imagine, if you're on infill or in time you need to be quiet and all your chem lights are banging into each other as you walk, that's no good. So the way I like to set them up is I take that band and I run it around my bundle of chems, whatever they be. Now it's quieted. I'm gonna hit wherever I'm going. I can either strip this off or I can just rip out a chem on the go. It's not really uh, a big deal. It just keeps things pretty simple for you and keeps your chems quiet. Silence, violence, silence, good principle to keep in mind. Okay, deploying your chem, all you're simply gonna do is just tear. And it cuts right through. It doesn't take very much force Normally when this is mounted to a belt, it's just a quick tug. It's way easier to tug uh, on this keychain cable and cut through than it is with any of the other methods that are out there. Uh, that's why we like these keychain cables so much. What I like to do, pre-training, pre-mission, whatever, I like to set up all my chem light bundles the way I like them. And store them in my kit uh, in a pouch. Depending on the scenario, maybe I'll keep them right on my belt. But I'll have maybe two, three bundles that I might stow on one utility hook, but I'll keep extras or other bundles prepped off to the side. Also, if it's a longer infill scenario and I don't want all this moving around, uh, one, you can use these, they stretch out a lot to secure multiple bundles together. Or you can just simply have these bundles prepared, keep them in your kit, and hit the time you're getting ready for the objective. Go ahead and clip them into your utility hook. So that's Chem Keepers, super simple. If you've never tried this method of carrying chems, highly recommend it. Uh, it makes life really easy. Again, we offer in two, five, and 10 packs.